We're at Liverpool Castle today to film Kettlebell Taters. Okay, currently in, currently in a crazy little castle room. Uh, it's got a fireplace there. Uh, yeah, pretty good. Liverpool Castle. Uh, it's near Horwich, like northwest England. So today's technique, we're going to be working on a kettlebell tater. If you don't know what a kettlebell tater is, don't worry about it. So a kettlebell tater is basically a Russian kettlebell swing that goes into a front squat. Um, good alternative to a clean kettlebell clean. So I'll give you a few demonstrations and a few little pointers. Super simple with this one. I'm gonna get the kettlebell. Set up the same as you would with a Russian kettlebell swing. Yeah. Up. Kettlebell tater. So you've got a Russian swing, which is the same as I said in a previous video, and I'll put a, um, I'll put a link to that one so you can check back the technique for that. And then um, when the kettlebell comes up to, to here and you're spinning it round, you don't want to really let go and then just hope and try and catch it. You want to pull it up and then make sure one hand goes on, second hand goes on and then ride it down into the squat. So, I'll give you a demonstration of that. One, two, there. So as you can see, cowbell comes up, one hand goes on, second hand goes on. Also, uh, depending on what kettlebell you have um, and the shape of it will determine on how you're able to, to get it into that goblet hold, the goblet squat. So, with this for instance, when it comes up, it's very difficult to try and grab it that way. So I have to spin it up here so it goes in this way and I can get a decent goblet grip on it, which will then ride it down into a squat. So things to remember, Russian kettlebell swings, same technique, just have the kettlebell slightly out front, out in front of you. You're gonna pull it back, nice, solid, strong back, and then we're swinging it up, driving through the hips, driving through the, uh, the hips, the glutes are gonna activate, and then when we get into here, it's one hand on, other hand on and then we're going to ride it down into a front squat um, ideally breaking parallel make sure you've got control of the kettlebell all the time and you're not just throwing it up and then just trying to catch it and hope for the best um, and just select uh, an appropriate weight so next video is going to include um, the Russian kettlebell swings and the um, kettlebell taters Okay, stay tuned for the next episode where we'll be doing a workout called Bell Bowl. It's a Wadwell workout which includes which includes kettlebell taters and some Russian kettlebell sw swings and a little bit of running. All right, until next episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you can. Much appreciated. Helps the channel and all that jive.